Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Minecraft story mode. We have not played this game in a long, long time and episode 5 has finally come out. Uh, I do apologize, I've just had other series going on, Craigcraft series and our Wither Boss UAC series which we both recently finished, uh, which is pretty awesome. So I just decided to have time to do something different and play some Minecraft story mode because episode 5 did come out quite a while ago and uh, if I go to the episodes... You'll see uh, when it lo loads up here that episodes 6, 7, and 8 are also coming soon. So uh, basically, I had I bought the game, the actual physical copy of the game, so it kind of gave me the season pass for episodes 1 through 5. But if you want to get 6 through 8, you can also buy them in this adventure pass thing now, which I, can, I guess saves money uh, rather than buying them separately. So I would definitely recommend doing that if you haven't already so I'll definitely be playing those when they do come out but uh, gotta get through episode 5 first so let's begin with uh, order up and see where our adventures are gonna take us today because I kind of don't remember what happened I think last time we defeated the wither wither guy the bad wither boss guy and now we're doing some other stuff so I don't know we'll see Alright, looks like we got some mobs here, boys. This is not good. We're rocking our, uh, our diamond gear, though. So, or not diamond, but whatever it is. Diamond sword and really good gear. Alright, looks like we're fighting some zombies here. Wait for them to get a little bit closer. There we go. So, we're rocking... Oh, hurt us a bit, hurt us a bit. It's okay, it's okay. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. This is actually some 1.9 combat mechanics right here, being able to hit multiple mobs with one uh, one sword hit. So I guess that's kind of how what they might be implementing with episode five. I'm no no idea here. Check this out. Nice, nice, nice. I'll give that skelly there. But yeah, it looks like they're going to be starting a new story here because they're all kind of new order members. They're all pretty awesome now. Three, two, one, pop. Whoa! <laughs> pretty cool, right? You can try it too. Yeah. So you got like a space helmet on or something? What is that? <laughs> no idea. Oh, nice, nice save. Dude, you're getting pretty good at this. All right, who is? Oh, that's that girl. Okay, I remember her now. I kind of forgot all the characters though. Nice arrow trap there. Good redstone stuff with those uh, Spencers. You're always looking to one up us, aren't you? Slick move, Jesse. Slick move. Seriously cool temple. Yeah, points for Ivor, I guess. This was a good tip. Well, Jesse. Um, let's do. So, are this. we doing this? Order of the stone. It's time to get some glory. For, For glory. glory. It's actually a pretty sweet-looking temple here. I know we all yelled glory out there, but I'm not gonna lie to you. I was hoping for treasure. Come on, you know how these places work. The treasure's never just out in the open. Let's fan out and search the place. Alright, so you gotta do a little searching. I like how it just kind of drops you into the story right where it left off, like, since they're all going on, uh, kind of their own missions and stuff now, it looks like. The center of the room. They look like they're designed to let lava flow from those channels in the wall. Why would you want to do that? All right, let's These check this out. These of lava are blocked by sticky pistons. If I were to unblock them, hmm. So we gotta probably pull these levers to unblock these lava channels, and then uh, it'll go through those channels down to the big center of the room. All right, might have to do a couple more times here. All right, still getting used to the controls again. I don't know, like it's been probably a couple months or so since I've played uh, the last episode. Maybe more. I have no idea. 
Oh, did that one stop? Hold up. Did this, so this one stopped then? I don't know why... Okay, I don't know why it stopped. Let's talk to Petra, see what Hi, she's Petra. doing. This place is cool. Knew you'd find it. Okay, I'm gonna keep trying to solve this. Alright, not too much help there. Uh, let's pull this last lever, see if it does. There might be a pattern, I'm not too sure. Locked again! Yeah, it has to be a pattern. Unless one of these guys knows something else. What you need, buddy? Uh, Axel, thoughts on the situation? situation. Um, I don't know about the situation. I kind of do more blowing stuff up. So if you need someone to do stuff like that, I'm totally your guy. Okay, I'm gonna keep working on this. Sounds good, dude. All right, he was not too much of a help, to be honest with you. Um, let's try to talk to the redstone girl. She might know something. Hey, Olivia. Olivia. Yeah. Uh, do do do. Any right ideas, ideas for how to fix this? Well, these channels of lava are blocked in strategic locations by those sticky pistons. Unblock them, and I'm guessing something cool will happen. Okay, I'm gonna figure right. this out. Never doubted you for a minute. <clears throat> I'm gonna do the middle. So he did one, the first one, the second one, and then the third one. I'm gonna do the middle one, and then I'm gonna just try different patterns, and hey, hopefully we can get this. Oh wait, no, it's not. Never mind. All right, let's start out with the third one then, which is over here, and we're just gonna keep trying this till we figure this this the right pattern out, I guess. So it has to be the first one, I guess, to start off, because the other two just won't work. So let's try first, then the third one, and then the middle one. Because the first one, the second one, and the third one didn't work in that order. Alright, so there we go. That's good. Now let's go after the third one. And if this doesn't work, then I'm really not too sure, to be honest with you. Hopefully this works, guys. Alright, wait, what? Let's go over here. Use this, please. Okay didn't work uh, let's go back to the, the first let's try the first and the second I thought the first second third didn't work I tried I tried that one before this one leaves them open is there something else I have to do it could be I can't like hit any of these buttons or anything down here uh, can't go over there all right ah uh, my old friend the Alright, that did not help at all. <laughs> See, then that one closes. Alright, so let's do this, and then the third... Uh, uh, let's do this, and then this, the, this one again. Uh, now we're getting somewhere. Alright, there we go. Now we got it. And then it should just be that last one. See, so yeah, I just a little bit of a pattern there. Uh, I'm honestly not the best with patterns like I've never I I like them when they're with numbers But like stuff like this. I don't really I'm not good at I guess puzzles and stuff. I'm not too great at There we go though I think I actually would have been disappointed if the floor didn't open up into a dark creepy passageway All right, here we go boys when we first found the orders temple We were such a scared bunch of noobs back then Hey, I wasn't scared. No. Then who was it that was yelling, Help me! Help me! The dispensers are trying to kill me! <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh-huh. And to think, that was just the beginning. Yeah, and that was before we'd fought weirder storms, hung out with Enderman, reunited the Order. So crazy. Yeah, these guys have done a lot together. It's a crazy looking place though. Bingo! Oh, right. I don't know. This might be trap, dude. Might be trap chest. I'm not sure on these. Hey, it's a cake! Man, this reminds me. 
reminds me of that time when you got a cake from that witch's hut, and I was super jealous of you. It's just, I really love cake. Hey, if you want it, it's <laughs> all you. Oh man, oh man, oh man, thank you. Huh, a pumpkin, not bad. I suppose that could be useful if we run into Enderman. And looks like we've got one more thing in here. It's... Whoa. It's like diamond flint steel. What the heck? What did you find? What are you guys talking about? Whoa. That's super cool. I've never seen flint and steel like that before. That glow. Is it some sort of enchantment? I don't know. I've seen people put an unbreaking enchantment on flint and steel before. But that's not unbreaking. You could give it a shot and find out. Okay, Flint and Steel, do your thing. Alright, boys, let's try this. Well, I have definitely never seen Flint and Steel do that before. Uh-oh. Oh, man. Got some bad guys here. I don't know what this Flint and Steel does. I guess it just spawns in mobs or something? Looks like some monsters have a death wish. So what's the plan? If you ask me, it seems like a good time for a secret handshake. Yeah, so let's use the redstone wrap. Obviously. Olivia, prep the redstone wrap. Nearly there. Okay, I like the redstone. Activate it now. All right, let's do it. Just clears them out really nice and quickly. Good job, Jesse. Worked perfectly. Whoa, you've so got to teach me how to make one of those. Yeah, pretty spectacular. All right, looks like we're trying to get out of here now. Ugh, all these mobs, where does it end? All right, let's get these guys out of here. Jesse's really gotten some skills from the first episode. Remember that guy? He was kind of like just a, kind of a lame dude, to be honest with you. Like, he didn't have much experience before, but now he's starting to, uh, able to handle himself on his own nicely. Alright, go, 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 go! <coughs> yeah, these stairs are start, starting to burn down since they're just all, uh, jungle wood, I think. We're trapped. Oh, no. Now what? Quick, jump. Let's okay, go up let's these vines. Alright, go, go, go! Looks like we can go. Cave oh spiders. shoot! Got some cave spiders. Cave spiders. Only way out of here is through them, so get ready. Seriously, these guys are like probably one of the most hated mobs by me. Like I really dislike them more than creepers, more than honestly like anything else. Nice, dude. Sick sword throw, bro. All right, we're good, boys. We are good. Don't don't lose the sword, dude. Do not lose the sword. Do not lose the sword, bud. I was gonna say, sword saved us many times. We're not losing it now. I tell you guys, doing that never gets old. Woo! Yeah, not too bad. Killing a bunch of monsters, getting sweet treasure. Like that flint and steel thing. You gotta try it again. I'd be curious to see it again, too. I'm dying to know how it works. I'm good. You can give it a shot, though. <laughs> I'm kind of scared what it's gonna do. Whoa, whoa. Well, well. It's like blue Where'd fire. You get the new toy? Who the heck is this clown? Order of the losers. Yeah. Losers. Ugh, who let you guys out of your cave? Sorry, but who are you again? Oh, I get it. The Order of the Stone is so fancy that they don't even recognize us anymore. Even though we used to wipe the floors with you guys every building competition. So what are you ocelots doing here anyway? The ocelots were Lucas's gang. We ditched that name just like we ditched him. Yeah, we rebranded. We're the Blaze Rods now. 
these rolls. Shut up, Gil. Wow, you guys are terrible at naming. That's a dumb name. <laughs> says the heroes that just called their group the new Order of the Stone. And where's Lucas, huh? The minute the Order decided you were cool... For whatever reason... ...he wouldn't stop sniffing around you like a tame dog. You take that back! Hmm... No. Hey, Lucas is ten times the guy you are. Petra, just ignore it. They don't know what they're talking about. Lucas is our friend, Jesse. No one talks about our friends like that. You probably think that thing makes you so special. Classic Jesse. You take all the best stuff and never give anyone else a chance. That should have been ours. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Blaze Rods. Hey, we earned this, all right? Fair and square. Yeah, we fought monsters, lava, and levers to get this thing, and we ain't giving it up. <laughs> Nothing you've ever done has been fair and square, Jesse. Hand over the flint and steel, Jesse. Don't make me ask again. You don't get that one. It's supposed to be mine. All right, here you we go. We're fighting me. these guys. We got them outnumbered Some here, boys. Hero, you are, Jesse. Fine. What hope do we have when heroes like you are throwing your weight around like this? It's not always going to be this way, though. Come on, you guys. Let's get out of here. Blaze Rod! Yeah, these guys are just sore Jesse, losers. Look They're honestly just Jesse. sore losers. I don't remember him being that angry before. Wow, us being the new Order of the Stone is really getting to that guy. He's gone crazy. We should be careful. He seems different, scarier. Man. And all because he wanted that flint and steel. What are you going to do with it? Ivor's the one that told us about this temple. He might know something about it. We're bringing it home. It'll be safe there. All right, let's see what we're doing now. Finally starting to recognize stuff again. Feels good to almost be home. Cheers to that, friend. I just can't shake what Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. Come on, Aiden's just jealous. Isn't that obvious? He sees us with our fancy armor, cool treasure, and he wishes he had it too. I guess so. It's a really cool city, to be honest. Well, no matter what Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? They think we're awesome. They're back! You guys, they're back! Run! Tell everyone that our heroes have returned! Yeah! <laughs> yep! New Order of the Stone is back in town! to see us scream. Wow, that's new. It somehow manages to evoke skulls and tentacles. Oh, that thing looks completely dangerous. Eh, not my fault. Look out! Oh, help! Oh, what is that? Whiny. Like, who built this? Your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? <sighs> of course. Oh, Jesse, you're back! Don't listen to a word these fools tell you. It's a fire hazard! And your face is an ugly hazard! Causing trouble again? <laughs> Just a little spirited debate with the local community. Brain function is proving difficult for them. You need to remove this now! Jesse, all I wanted was what any man wants. 
a little house of my own, with loads of lava pouring off it. Ivor, I know you mean well, but your house wants to kill people. Dude, you made a killer house. Exactly! Killer! What about just moving it someplace else? I'm sure... Move it? Way more lava is going to spill out if we do that. Well, we have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. <laughs> it's my house, Jesse. Ivor obviously put a lot of work into his new house. We need to show it the same respect that we would show a house not dripping with lava. Leave it. I'm sure we can find a way to work around it, okay? Yeah, I don't want Ivor to turn on us, so I'm gonna let him have it for now. Thanks, Jesse! Because That's if he gets right. mad at us, you know, he could do some bad stuff Keep again. Walking. So, nice to hopefully the community's okay with that. Ha uh ha. -huh. Haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you, Jesse? Ivor, we found something. Oh, uh, I got something. About. What? You did? <laughs> yes. Great to see you again. Let's do lunch. I'll bring the carrots. There's no telling who's listening. Meet me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. And bring the thing you found! Oh, so it looks like it's a pretty big deal, whatever it is. Well, if we're going to keep that thing up, we should at least encase the lava in some glass to make it safer. But, like, not too safe. Come on, help me collect some sand. And you can make sure that when we bake it into glass, it's the right amount of safe. Okay. We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we make sure this art gets the respect it deserves. Stay out of trouble, you two. <laughs> you stay out of trouble. Good one. Thanks. Later, guys. Come on, let's go find Ivor. All right, so now we gotta uh, go see what Ivor is uh, all worried about or freaked out about. It didn't sound too good, so. Wow. Hopefully it's really not bad. Up. I don't know. <clears throat> Looks like these are all kind of like just metals or items that we've gotten from raids or whatever. I don't know. We just found that some Whoa, cool treasure and stuff. Lucas? I don't believe it. Oh, hey guys. You have some pretty cool stuff in here. Hey, Lucas. Great to see you. It's been a while. I really missed you guys. We missed you, too. You have so many other treasures. Boy, you've sure been busy. Oh, wow. You framed it. I'm him. Yeah. How are you doing? I really, really miss him. Every morning I wake up and just for a minute, can pretend that he's just in another room or rooting around outside looking for carrots. And then every morning I get to remember all over that he's gone. I'm so sorry. <sighs> okay, guys. I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out. I actually came back because I need to tell you something. It's about this weird run-in I had with Aiden. Ugh, uh -oh. I hate that guy. Uh-huh, yeah, we saw him too. The Order of the Stone and the Blaze Rods are just as friendly as ever. That's an understatement. He's just been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Witherstorm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took over the Ocelot and the Blaze Rods, it just seems like he's gotten meaner. He's pushing Maya and Gil around. Jealous? Why? He thinks you're a big bully, Jesse. Looting and keeping all the good stuff for yourself. So what'd you find that got Aiden so excited, anyway? Check it out. Wow. What a weird glow. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to show it to... You found it! No! Ah, dude, what's wrong with you? This is the greatest find of our time. I can't believe you're actually... Okay, Spill, what's it do? It proves what I've always suspected. That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Whoa. What? Wow, I didn't know there was a time before the Order of the Stone. It's incredible, isn't it? 
I haven't even gotten to the best part. You see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer to finding the Eversource. What a beautiful sight. Looks like what you came that? back just in time, Lucas. The Ever... what now? The Eversource! Are you, uh, gonna actually explain it any more than that? The Eversource is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. Think about it, Jesse. That temple must have been its hiding place! Wow. Old builders? You learn something new every day. Okay, so this flint and steel might have this old builder enchantment, but how do you know that's where this Eversource thing is? I've traveled near and far, Jesse, and that temple, that flint and steel, is the only firm proof that I've ever seen of the old builders. That does seem like a pretty good bet. Old builders, ever sources, ancient mysteries. You know I'm in. Excellent! I'll pack my adventuring things immediately. Wait, he's coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. I, uh, guess I'll take off. Nope. You're coming with. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. <laughs> Let's get moving. Yeah, Ivor's still uh, crazy as always, you know? But at least he's on our side now, you know? That's pretty cool. But that is probably where we're going to be ending it today. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's episode of Minecraft Story Mode. We will be continuing next time. Definitely check the playlist out if you missed any of the other videos in the past. And check it out down below in case the next part is already out by the time you're watching this one. Don't tell you some guys. Have a great day and I'll catch you on my next video.